Hey, it's me, furry face. What else? I got a bitch about something, you know. It's always something. Fuck. Anyway, might as well talk to you about my trip to the hospital. Since I didn't have much choice, I couldn't get a doctor any other way. I tried an appointment. That failed, because some idiot that works there thought I might have the virus, when I didn't. It was, come on, you know. She said, you said you were coughing. I said, I didn't say I was coughing. They, they make up their own shit, I swear. I told them, look, I just said I had a hard time breathing because I've been missing my meds for two freaking months. That's why I need to see a doctor, you know. So she, she for, forbid me from entering the place, so I had to go home. How fucking dumb is that? Christ. So I couldn't see a doctor now. So it's like, oh, for fuck's sake, and that's after making an appointment. So it's like, never mind. My next alternative was to phone an ambulance, get my ass to the hospital, see a doctor. It's the only way, you know. So I did that. You know, fuck. Yeah, finally, I did get my meds. I'm going to show you what they are. This is the two different pump sprays. I forget what they're freaking called, but anyway, some scientific term. And I have this tube that I'm using. I'll do one just to show you. It's not going to kill me, so yeah. You know, put it in there. Oh, well, you're supposed to shake it. Get the gas nice and fluid like. And you, you press it and inhale through the tube. <sighs> I missed it. Hang on. <sighs> ah, nice. All right. Mm. And one of the other one. What the heck? I just got these, so they should last uh, almost a month now. Shake it. Uh, Hold that stupid thing down. Uh, it's just the cap cover to cover the end, but anyway. Uh. Nice. As I smoke. I know. Kind of counterintuitive, but uh, fuck. Such is my stupid life. You gotta live somewhat, you know. Fuck. I know I'm gonna have to quit somewhere down the road, and I'm not happy about that, okay? Uh. Anyway. They also tested me for COVID, and I was told by the helper uh, nurse that was attending to me, who did pretty well, I might add. He was on top of things, getting things done, you know, because that's what I needed, you know. Anyway, and they told me they'll phone me the next day with my results about COVID, whether I have it or not. Yeah, no phone call. So I phoned the hospital. And it took me a while to, for them to answer properly. It was through their fucking menus and all this bullshit. Finally, I get somebody, and they transfer me to the records department, so I've got to explain what I'm looking for again, you know. And then they tell, oh, we don't do that. We send you a letter in two weeks. And I'm like, fuck, you know. Gee, thanks, you know. <clears throat> Idiots. You know, fuck, come on. i got to wait two weeks, you know, if I'm infected or not. That's fucking dumb. So it's like, fuck. Yeah. Luckily, my meds, though, are good for, like, a year. Uh, once a month I can get them. The government pays. Until I'm 65, then I'm fucked. Yeah, because then I go on my pension, which doesn't mean a hell of beans. I'm not getting a lot of money there. So I'm going to be in the same boat, but I won't be able to pay for my meds. Oh, how nice. Or dental, or eye surgery, or anything I might need when I age and fuck up. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to have a harder time. I'm going to have to find a rent subsidy place soon. But that doesn't happen soon. I hear there's like a five-year fucking waiting list. Hell, I could be dead before then. That's ridiculous. Christ. I always have these kind of problems, all with doctors, fucking governments, pharmacies. There's always a fucking problem. I wish I could just rob the pharmacy and get what I needed, you know? Oh, I thought about it. <laughs> but <laughs> that's a bit risque, you know what I mean? And there's no way to really rob them without setting off all kinds of alarms. And I'm not in shape to go scaling a fucking roof with a drop cord so I can lower myself down with my pack sack full of crap that I need, you know, then get my ass home. I can't pull it off. No mission impossible for me. It's like shit. So it's all fucking crap every fucking time. Anyway, as it stands, I'm not going foraging right away. Fuck that. I gotta let my body recuperate. Although it is recuperating, I'm feeling. Well, I'd say about 20% better, 25% better, shit. I can go across the other side of my apartment, which is a studio apartment. It's one room, you know, and I can come back without, you know, having to breathe so freaking heavy. I was retarded. That's why I had to hurry up and get my ass to the hospital since I wasn't able to see a doctor properly. It's just 
This virus thing really fucks things up, man. Fuck. And now my second shot, I couldn't even confirm it on the internet. Now it fucks up on my computer, so it won't let me confirm shit. So, and I don't have a cell phone to confirm anything either. So, and they don't answer their fucking phone. So, what the fuck do they have a phone for if they're not answering it? It's like, ah, you know, morons. There's too many morons in this fucking world. Seriously. Ah. And common sense. Jesus, where the hell is that now, you know? Fuck. This new age way of thinking is fucking stupid. Go back to using common sense. Talk to your elders. Fuck, you know. Get a little common sense in there. Shit. It's getting retarded now. Anyway. Whew, it's a lot of bitching. <laughs> At least I can breathe through it a little easier. I'm glad to have my meds. I have another one. It's Beriva. It's a powder. and It's in a little capsule. And you put it in this thing. You push the button. It bursts the capsule. And you suck in the powder. Yeah. It's called Spiriva. Anyway. That's uh, generally what I have for my meds besides some blood pressure pills. I didn't take one today. <laughs> yeah, I should. Anyway, ah, uh, fuck. Hmm. The only thing I didn't get on my prescription, because I didn't think I needed any right away. Because I don't take an access to stuff, you know. I'm not that greedy, for Christ's sake. I take what I need, yeah. But that's about it. I'm pretty straightforward like that. But of course, places assume the worst, you know. Ah. Uh. Didn't go down. Ah, uh, all right. Well, they taste horrible. But anyway, blood pressure pills. Ugh. Look, I had something in my mind, and now it just went away. Anyway, huh? that's what happens when you get older. Look, I hate getting older. It's not fun. You don't uh, enjoy your uh, what? Your golden years, unless you're wealthy. Otherwise, it just sucks. Okay. You get old, your body falls apart, you have a hard time with doctors and pharmacies and shit. Uh, and your options are more limited because you're not wealthy, you know? So it really sucks. Uh, I hope I can find a way to do myself in before I have to go to an old folks home. Because they're even worse. Thank Christ. Yeah, I know a guy who has to restrain his mom in the hospital because she wants to escape all the time. You get, that must be really hard on a child to have, well, a child, he's an adult now, but have to uh, have his mother restrained in her freaking chair or bed or whatever. That's bad, man. It's like, fuck, I don't know if I'd have the balls to do that to my mom. It'd be like, fuck, you know, keep trying to escape. At least it's something to do, you know. <laughs> they're occupied with it, at least, you know, fuck. Like they're escaping from some concentration camp. Can't do this, can't do that. I could imagine, you know. But I hate that too. And they want, and now he put down the order to restrain her. It's like, Jesus, fuck. I hate to be this guy's mom. It's like, shit. Anyway, he's going to know who I'm talking about. He watches my videos too. But the truth is, you know what I mean? I don't usually hide from the truth. But you do have to be careful. Uh, if you talk about COVID, 19, if you talk about uh, antivirus or the vaccine, if you talk about pharmacies or doctors, you risk getting your video yanked off by YouTube. So you have to title it something else, you know, seriously. You can't title it, you know, Corona-19 or vaccine or anything of that nature. You gotta watch yourself. Fuck. Because whether it's the truth or not, they don't care. They just don't want you talking bad about some other thing that's readily... Uh, what people need nowadays or something. That's fucking stupid. But anyway, I'm a truth teller. So you're going to get it the way it is. I don't fuck around with that, you know? Anyway, and I think I have common sense, you know? That's <laughs> how I can spot it when it doesn't exist. It's like, Christ, it's very annoying. Anyway, furry face out. Uh, toodaloo kangaroo. Uh, chow now, brown cow. Later, alligator. In a while, crocodile. I think I had it. Later, alligator. I don't know, even know if I had that one. Anyway, furry face out. Don't forget to subscribe. Oh, and this is my face. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon for more of my wonderful videos of enlightenment. Well, ciao.